leading off in the third inning. It'll be Arenado, Gonzalez, and Story against Perdomo. Oh, oh, here goes oh, Nolan out to the back. Look at this. And the benches have cleared. There is a melee on the infield. Nolan Arenado had a ball go behind him. He threw his helmet down, ran toward the pitcher's mound. Perdomo threw his glove down. Bench is cleared. Here come the bullpens as well. Umpires right in the middle of this. Mark McGuire knows Nolan very well. This is not contentious. He's trying to calm him down. Car goes in there. Nolan had to have an idea that it may be coming because two guys after last night, even though they were far from intentional, got hit. And that one had purpose. Perdomo's got to go. Nolan will be gone. And A.J. Ellis and Nolan still trying to get in. Cargo's now trying to make sure it's just it's just today for Nolan. You don't want anything more than that. Where this pitch is. Well, actually, He's I, thought, to it was, I thought it was a little higher than that. But the Rockies Nolan, have had it. I mean, they've had look, it. They're the, frustrated right now. Yeah. Nolan's had it. Perdomo threw his glove straight at Nolan. When play resumed, the Rockies came out in full force, scoring five runs, enough to eventually win 6-4. to four. After a game that saw both teams pitching aggressively inside, we will see if it's over now that the Padres are back in Denver in just 11 days.